Hello viewers, we power I here and welcome to today's video of a full body stretching routine from head to toe. It is simple and easy to follow and suitable for all levels. All you need is a mat, a chair and a wall. Begin with a nice back stretch all the way up. Really stretches my mid back and upper back and it feels very relaxing. Now move into the neck rotations, slowly, then each side, hold, Back to front, hold, don't overstretch it, just hold and feel the stretch. Another back stretch for the upper back. Pull yourself forward, hold. Similarly backward, hold and relax. Now the side of the arms, onto the triceps. I find extending the arm up and holding it stretches the whole arm better. Now the shoulders, remember to do it slowly, don't overstretch and breathe. Rotate the shoulders back and feel the stretch. Stretching the forearms, bending forward and backward, Some rotation of the fingers and wrist.
Side bending for the lower back. Do as you're comfortable. Don't force it. Raise the hand and you see the stretch in the hip flexors in the bottom of the abdomen. Front and back bending, keep the knees a little bent, Full 360 rotation as much as you're comfortable. Cobra stretch on the floor, raise up the back. Put your head back and look up, remember to breathe, twist the lower body, feel the lower back loosening. Now the chest. Make sure the elbows are bent, keep it natural. Next, stretching the shin. If you're imbalanced, you can use the support of the wall and don't overstretch. The shin and the foot are slightly sensitive. Stretching the hamstrings, you can see I'm not yet able to touch the floor, but by the end I can definitely put my palms down. Moving to the lower body. First the quadriceps. At this point I realized I put the wrong leg in front. So the leg against the wall is in front and the opposite leg is the one you will be stretching. You can take the support of the wall if needed. Keep the back straight and hold the ankle not the toes. And now I realize it's not visible to the camera.
Find your balance and pull the anchor. Don't strain your back. Do as much as you can. Keep your front leg at 90 degrees or any comfortable angle. Switch the leg. Camel pose, bend back, hold your ankles. Now stretching the hip flexors, lower back and the hamstrings at the same time. Try and keep your back straight, stretch slowly, don't force it. Go down. Now try to touch your chest to the leg in front. Bend to the opposite side, stretch that hip flexor. Now pull back and stretch the hamstring. Same on the opposite side. If you like the video so far, do subscribe, like it, share it with your friends. Now stretching the calves. Initially stretch one at a time slowly. Now slowly put both ankles on the floor as much as you can. Now down into Vajrasana. Keep your back straight. Now the glutes or butt muscles.
pull from one side and push on the other. Doing it every day will make it much more flexible and your body will feel much lighter. Other leg. After this stretching, you can see I can almost put my palms on the floor, which proves that the stretching routine really works. For the final exercise, squat down on the floor. With your heels down, keep your knees pointed out. If you're flexible enough, you can keep your hands up, which will engage the back. You can also stretch the Achilles in this way. have another sip of water and now we are done. If you liked it, share and subscribe for more like this. Hope this helped. Thank you for watching and see you again. Bye.